What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Um, we are about to get into Krishan. I keep saying that because Krishan the one who made it do it. But shout out to Blueface. He is number nine on trending for music. However, <laughs> um, what's crazy is Krishan is also trending for music. Now, I I can't say he didn't. I, I'm not going to say he's not trending because of Krishan. He's absolutely trending because of Krishan. But the song was catchy. Baby Mama Drama is the song. Makes sense. That's why I'm saying all of this is coming together. The boy is a genius. And he letting it be known that he is. Don't forget, Blueface went to college. Bro, low-key a nerd. Me too, though. He like a thug nerd, but you know what I'm, saying? I'm, a, I'm a pedestrian nerd. You get what I'm saying? Um, but he is number nine trending on music on YouTube. So shout out to him for that. Um, I also want to get into, um, what's her name? Is it impressive? No, it's all access. I want to get into what Blueface said about Lil Baby. Y'all, I missed it yesterday. <laughs> I absolutely missed that yesterday in the song. And I seen in the comments, some people was flaming me about missing it. Girl, I completely missed it. So we're going to get into that because I can't believe I missed that. But let's fucking drop the new song and a new music video yesterday. And in this song, Baby Mama Drama, he was dissing Lil Baby. A couple of days ago, Lil Baby previewed a snippet of his new song. And he was like, he put a million up a hundred times. What the F is a blue face? Blueface obviously didn't like that and he dissed Lil Baby, but you guys My remember baby. on 4th of July, Michael Rubin was having an all white party and Lil Baby was spotted a little too close to Michael Rubin and another guy and he was not a little too close. Why is you all on my back like this? Why is you hugging my back? <laughs> Get off of me. Getting clowned all over social media, and now he's getting dissed by Blueface. How you let another grown man fill up on your booty? Couldn't be me, boy. I'm, I'm not, not a hoochie. You were y'all right. I thought he was talking about Krishan. You're absolutely right. I absolutely fumbled that whole video for that reason. Yeah, and now he's getting dissed by Blueface. <laughs> How you let another grown man fill up on your booty? Couldn't be me. Boy, I am not a hoochie. Wow. You niggas really in the street. I, I ain't really in the street. Hello? People on the social media started chiming now in. Blue One person said, not Blueface coming for little Baby. He need to slow his roll. <laughs> no. Another user chimed in and said, did Blueface eat little Baby up or did little Baby eat Blueface up? <laughs> Blueface only asked a valid question. How you let another grown man fill up on your booty? Facts. Lil Baby can't even be mad. Now, some I mean, the nigga said, he didn't ask. He said, how you let another nigga fill on your booty, but then answered. Like, couldn't be me, boy. I'm not a hoochie. Like, what? People on social media I did like Blueface this. However, some did not. I One person said Blueface King rapping that little baby line was as trash as his career. Nah, Someone that else wasn't said Blueface been fiending for clout dissing little baby and he nowhere near on his level. That well, you guys, let me know your thoughts in the piece. He ain't nowhere near on his level, but that wasn't a lie. Down in the comment <laughs> section below, how did you guys I mean, feel about Blueface right? diss towards Lil Baby? Moving on to the next topic. So, Blueface manager Wack 100 was on No Jumper. Oh, yeah, I and he was alleging that Blueface ended up sleeping with DJ Academics' girlfriend unknowingly. Uh -huh. And that's why DJ Academics is so mad at Blueface. Nephew, forgive me. Axe hating on Blueface because Blueface knocked his bra down. That's it. Now, mind you, I'm watching the live last night with uh, Academics, which. Y'all, academics is another genius, period. But so is whack. Whack baited academics. It wasn't even real. Like, he baited them. It was cap. It was cap. It, no, no, because you notice how he came out of nowhere with it? Shay, girl. I ain't going to tell you which one. Shut the fuck up. Look, bro. That's act. Like, these little bros, they run into the... Bro, it goes down like that. I Who watched Ray J hit LaDamian Thomas' wife when he was rapping. still at the Chargers. Facts. Motherfucker can't tell me nothing. I just seen the best of the best get hit. Not nah, Shay Glizzy. <clears throat> Listen, bro. Shay Glizzy. What? <laughs> Glizzy so whatever oh, Hack had to say about Blueface, Hack, that's my brother. But now we got to clear it up and let people know why you why you so butthurt. Nephew knocked the brawl down. And nephew defense. And Wax said that shit with a, a smile on his face as if he was not lying at all about that shit. 
He didn't know. <laughs> he didn't Funny go like after. It. Or acting, though. No, Blue didn't know. Y'all, mind you, all of this is cap. <laughs> so, Blue, uh, Wack and Ack went back and forth last night on his stream. Because Wack was talking about, Ack was talking about it for an hour, literally. He was so upset. And it was cap. It was cap. No cap. It was cap. He didn't just go after his broad. But, it, you know, it popped up. It happened. And I went through the phone, and he found some shit. And that, you know, he going at Blueface. I'm talking about Butter. That's what I'm talking about. Who, FBG Butter, butter. He, he told, is, is crying in the police station. Did somebody egg academics? Why? Who, FBG Butter. Damn. Butter, he told, is, is crying in the police station with an Alpha Davis signature. So he signed papers. He signed a statement. Well, this whole what <laughs> situation what is a mess. Happened? DJ Academics did respond and said that WAC 100 was lying. But you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Child. Y'all heard what happened. I don't know. Uh, WAC. Wack will pull something out of his ass. I watched him do it yesterday. I swear. <laughs> I, was watching. I was watching what was going on as it was unfolding. And your boy pulled that from the depths, okay, of his behind. And it was Cap. I do got to see the one Tasha, talking about Tasha K. Where is that at? Yeah. Where, where is the, um, the Tasha K clip at? Wack, Tasha K. Hold on. This is a month ago. Okay, this is seven hours ago, four minutes. All let's right. let's step off of the 4K tray question since I believe that it is quite clear that we are both joining. Um, let's talk about the fact that we've had a few different WAC 100 ops stopping by the building. Some surprise visits. I was just telling you about a, a former street affiliate of yours. I'm not sure if you would want to mention his name, but uh, he came in here, had a whole litany of uh, complaints about you. Hey, listen. One I thing listened about, attentively. One thing about complaints, right? I heard him out. Complaints got to be back with facts. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people tell a lot of stories. Okay. Like you. But um, <laughs> documentation beats conversation. Now, what you mean you had a whole lot of whack ops? Well, okay. So there's the guy I told you about before. Uh huh. Then we had Tasha uh -huh. K stop by. Okay. Oh, she did. She, did she, Tasha K really stopped by? Tell you about our. Did you tell her that I told you about us? Here's the thing. Did you tell her? Did Tasha K really stop by? Or these niggas was just baiting everybody yesterday? That whack told you about our little thing? I did ask her if she ever had sexual relations with you. What did she say? She looked horrified. Oh um, she's been with her husband since she was in her early 20s. She got about, well, I ain't going to put her there. But, and so what did she say? Did she answer the question? If she was with you? Did she answer the question on camera? This nigga said, I'm going viral tomorrow. Yeah, she said no. So, and then that's all she said? I mean, most of her other response, the rest of her response was mostly like verbal, nonverbal gestures that she was like horrified. She kind of looked like she was going to throw up. You know me and Tasha look alike. <laughs> I would not do that to her. But me and Tasha K looks alike. Yo, what? She's a very. Um, You're more of a caramel. She's a very pretty guy. Pretty guy. <laughs> she's a woman. Do y'all see Black laugh, bro? This is some evil shit right here. Look at his laugh. I would not do that to her. But me and Tasha K looks alike. She's a very. Um, You're more of a caramel. She's a very pretty guy. Pretty guy. <laughs> she's a woman. Whack. That's my point. I can call her a pretty guy because she's a real woman, but she's pretty as a guy. Now, if you got a female that's a very, that's pretty as a guy, then she's fucked up as a girl. <laughs> I feel like. Yo, this nigga whack crazy for that. <laughs> what the fuck? You. Tasha K is the definition of a walking Oxymoron. <laughs> Yo, why is he dying laughing like this? 
Shout out to Cardi B. Yo, yo, listen. Shout out to my spies on the other side and my squad because she know what I did to her. Why am I doing a podcast with a, a <laughs> villain, a super villain here? Look at him. Yo, yeah, he trying I love to break her. He's amazing. Problem, but you know what? I was checking her out. If you day. slept with her, feel free to show me some receipts right now. Text messages, images of some sort, Something. anything. I'm not. These niggas ain't say alleged or nothing. Oh, my God. No cap, Cardi B wouldn't even be able to take him to uh to court right now. Seeing it. Shout out to all my winos. I know you're out there. This oh, nigga yeah. shouted out to winos. It's crazy. This isn't going to be as easy as me finding the definition. Uh, hoodwinked and bamboozled into thinking he was going to hide all the assets over there until my spies found it and I sent it in to the home girl and exposed where it was at. Remember before, I yes, remember I, before I, when I, they said yeah. Cardi B only got $900 or $9,000? Now, five days after I posted the shit and got it to where $220,000 is the offer, can we pay you a quarter? You know why? Because she was hiding the assets in the hunt inside the clubhouse and my spy team, we found them and I exposed her. Why do you want to ruin this woman? Listen, I don't think she did anything wrong to Cardi B. Definitely uh, did. What? Don't miss your homegirl name. We ain't doing that. Shout out to Cardi B. I also. can't say Cardi B, but you nope. can? Yeah, I can. That's my homegirl. I was supposed to meet up with her uh, relatively recently. <laughs> nah, you don't need to meet with Cardi. Yeah, yeah. Cardi, we ain't doing that. There's a new cereal out called The Whoops, and uh, she has been doing a little bit of endorsement. That's my homegirl. For the Cardi Whoops. B has never, ever changed with me. What do you think the top Yo. Tasha K said about they muted their ass. Y'all. Uh, well, it's giving cap. It's definitely giving cap. Um, I don't believe it. <laughs> so, yep, that's all I got. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. We're done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.